Sophia's call. Well done, Arm. We'll end today's training here. Your swordsmanship has come a long way. I've always known you had talent. You really think so? You're not just saying that, are you, Grandfather? Either I'm getting old or you're getting better. And we both know I'm not old. <laughs> well, good. Then that means you're ready to let me travel outside the village. Hmm. Don't misconstrue my words, boy. The rule still stands. But why? I'm not a child anymore. You just said I can fend for myself. If I meet with any dangers, I'll have my sword and my wits. Arm, um, that's not what this is about. Then what is it about? Arm. Um. Look, I've heard from the others. I know the droughts made Zofia a scary place. People are starving, and many have turned to thievery and plunder. Brigands loot villages for a mere sack of grain, and soon they'll be at our door. And don't think I haven't heard what the Regellian army has been up to. They've been crossing the border for years in violation of the Divine Accord. And with that sacred bond broken, now the terrors have resurfaced as well. All true. Zofia is full of innocent people who are looking for help. Please, Grandfather. I want to make a difference in a world bigger than a handful of houses. I want to see all the amazing places you've told me about, that Selica told me about. Suppose you do set forth with your sword and your wits. So what? <laughs> Will the grand story of your life be how you met the end of a brigand's axe? Before you dream of changing the world, learn your damn place in it. And no more talk of leaving. What's his problem? Why teach me to use a sword if you're not going to let me fight? Every day in this place is exactly the same as the next. I know I meant for more than this, but you have to let me find it. Huh? What's all the commotion? It's coming from the gates. Hmm. Okay, so what do I do now? Are we, are we visual novel style now? Talk. Examine? Ooh, I can examine stuff. Damn it, this is not voiced. Voice everything, damn it. Voice everything. I want everything to be voiced. A lot of the voice actors sound- Ooh, oranges! A lot of the voice actors- Wait, what? I can pick up oranges? Oh, what the hell? I can pick up oranges! A lot of the uh, voice actors sound really familiar, but that's to be expected from a game like this. You actually do hire the good voice actors. Pretty sure I've heard them before recently. Just can't pinpoint. Oh, I can actually pick up an axe too. So you actually need to look around and, and uh, pick stuff up. Menu? Order. Inventory? Okay. What does this do? Health? Health 10, fatigue S. I don't know what that means. What is fatigue? Okay. Combat forecast. Standard simplified. Damn it, there's no more complicated version then. Okay, let's move to the square. Oh wow, there's actually people. Oh, you can talk to everyone. Is this really Fire Emblem? What the hell is this? <sighs> what I wouldn't give for some food. It's been years since we've had a proper harvest. 
Can't grow much without rain. Do I give Why her an orange? Why has forsaken us? What's happened to the Earth Mother? She's killing us by withholding her blessings. The Regalian Empire will seize our lands, and we'll be too weak to resist. You've heard how well-trained their soldiers are, haven't you? We've never toiled or fought for a thing, and we're about to pay for it. Nor. Wait, so not everyone's voiced. They should have just voiced everyone. Like, come on. I know it's expensive, but come on. Damn, this old man wants his wine. Well, if it is an alm, you all finished with today's training? I still remember when you were only this tall. And now look at you. Sir Mycin has certainly made a strong young man out of you. I say Sir Mycin, but the story is your grandfather was once a famous general. General Mycin. <laughs> I always wondered why such a fellow would end up here. She has a tiny again, head. The woods around Ram have become dangerous as of late. Perhaps it's for the best that we have him and you to keep us safe. She has a really tiny head. It looks disproportionate. The character design in this game I really like. It's by uh, an artist named Hidari. Hidari actually did the character design for the Atelier series, the Dusk Trilogy, which I think has the best character design out of all of them. I think the most, the, the latest one, the Mysterious Trilogy, has the worst character design so far. I mean, if you compare it to, to the older games, the older games obviously don't look that good. Like, 90s style character design doesn't look as good as present day character design, but... Like, some of the, the, the character design in the newer games just look ridiculous. Some of them are good, though, but I think the most consistently good one was the Dusk Trilogy by the artist who did this game. It's good to know our plight has the nobility so grief-stricken. King Lima dances at the end of Chancellor Desai's puppet strings. The king would rather eat grapes and frolic in a seraglio than actually rule. It's no wonder the kingdom's being torn apart by rebellion after rebellion. <sighs> I wish someone would come along and save us from ourselves already. What's that? The Mother Milla? <laughs> I can waste my prayers on a goddess as useless as her. Damn non-believers. So we have people that, are, that believe in Milla and people that don't. Well, believe as in they, they trust her. Can I pick up those carrots? Oh yeah. I'm just gonna loot the, the entire village. Might as well. Flower. Maybe this is the Atelier series. This is definitely not Fire Emblem as I know it. Which is good. This is this is definitely definitely really fresh. Ram Village though. Oh hey, I know these people. This fellow's here to see Sir Mycin, and he was just about to tell us more. That's Lucas from Fire Emblem Heroes. Definitely not from this game. Let's talk to the others first. Sorry, pal, but I still can't trust a man in full armor. Keep one hand on your hilt while you talk to this guy, yeah? Isn't Alm in full armor? Alm actually looks the, the most out of place here. I guess he looks kind of like Lucas. He's in full armor. But it makes no sense for Alm to be in full armor, so that's like a, a one of those weird design choices, I think. A knight? Can you believe it? What's he doing in our village? You'd have to practically ride off the edge of the map to find this place. I don't know why he's so excited considering the net the last time a knight appeared in the village, bad stuff happened. Uh, Alm! How is sword practice? Everything go okay? Sir Mycin is far too hard on you. I hope you don't have any new bruises. Damn, these voice actors sound so familiar. But I, I can't pinpoint them. You sure come a long way just to find a whole lot of nothing. 
Whatever he's here for, I hope he hasn't brought any trouble with him. All right. Good day. You must be Sir Myson's grandson. Oh, was it? My name is Lucas. I fight for the Deliverance. The Deliverance? What's that? Aren't you one of the Knights of Zofia? The King's Knights? Oh, I see. I suppose that means word hasn't yet reached your village. In that case, please forgive me for heralding such dark news, but King Lima IV is dead. He met his end some days ago at the hands of Chancellor Desai. What? You're saying it was regicide? I fear so. It seems Desai sold Zofia to the Regalian Empire, along with his soul. No doubt they promised him lands, perhaps even a title. Upon Lima's death, the Chancellor and the Regalian army seized Sophia Castle and began to visit unspeakable injustices upon the King's people. Sir Clive, of the Knights of Sophia you mentioned, would have none of it. He formed an army to free us from Regal and named it the Deliverance. However, we are outmatched and fast losing this war. We need a hero's aid. And so, I have come to the home of one of Sophia's greatest heroes. Sir Myson. Do you see, Alm? Sir Clive would not have sent me were it not urgent. Will you take me to see your grandfather? Uh, yes, of course. Good goblets. I knew Zofia was in hot water, but is this guy serious? So there's going to be a war? There already is one from the sound of things. But that's... that's awful. If Sir Myson rides off to war, what'll happen to Alm? You got me. Dun dun dun. Lucas, were you able to speak with my grandfather? What did he say? He said no. Sir Myson made it clear he has no intention of joining the Deliverance. What? But he's ridiculously strong. He could defeat some stuffy chancellor with his eyes closed. Why would he refuse when so many people are suffering? I cannot speak to Sir Myson's thinking, but it seems we misplaced our hopes. I'll have to return to our hideout and bring Sir Clive the ill news. Perhaps Myson has simply grown too old for the battlefield. <laughs> it was good meeting you, Alm. I must be on my way. Thank you again for your assistance. He's not old. He's tougher than men half his age. It's probably true, considering he destroyed that paladin. Lucas, wait! Um, what is it? I'll go. I'll join the Deliverance. You? Oh, what the hell? You can't do that. Wait, can you do that? I'll admit, you fight like a beast and they'd be lucky to have your sword. But this isn't sparring with your grandson. You're volunteering to go to war. I know what it is. And if Grandfather won't do it, then I'll do it for him. Consider my sword as his. Um, I understand how you feel, but... Sir Myson has been teaching me to use a blade since I was a boy. I've received tutelage in military tactics, medicine, weather, terrain. I know as much about war as any man who has never seen one can. Let me fight for you with my grandfather's gifts. I'll prove he's no cowardly old man. He's a warrior who trains warriors. Hmm. That might just work. Huh? Then you mean... Oh, come on. You can't be serious. Why not? Alm presents a good case. He has a hero's blood in him, and clearly a hero's fire. His presence is sure to raise the troops' morale. And for my part, I'm curious to see what a self-proclaimed warrior can do. Especially now that he'll be doing it for the Deliverance. Thank you, Lucas. You won't regret this. Uh, I've seen a lot of cake taking in my day, but this really takes the cake. I love Gray. Oh, you should back lines. This. It's far too dangerous. If anything were to happen to you, I'd... I mean... Just don't do it, okay? I'm sorry, Faye, but I've made up my mind. But maybe all of you could come with me. Yeah, let's just recruit villagers. What? 
Splendid idea. Maybe we could all get impaled on the same lance. Sounds good. I'm just saying we could do it together. Fighting, I mean, not the lance. Grandfather trained all of us, right? Not just me. You already know how to use a sword and a bow. So what's the problem? Oh, uh, are you insane? We were sparring with wooden fences and tree trunks. They don't hit back. Oh, sod it all. I'm not as bright as I'd like to think I am, so, uh, count me in. Yay, Gray! Not you too! Me too, Toby Poo. It's better Toby than Poo? for Regal to reach Ram and kill, slash, and slave us. Might as well bring the fight to them. But you're gonna. I mean, once they. <sighs> you have my thanks, Gray. And the deliverance welcomes you. In the end, we need every able fighter we can get. There will be much to learn, but I can teach you a great deal in battle. And you'll be given a proper wage, of course. Wait, uh, you mean we get paid? As in actual money? Of course. Our soldiers work hard and sacrifice much. We would be remiss not to offer compensation. <sighs> I've got little brothers and sisters who could use that gold. Ma and Pa struggle to make ends meet. But if there's a way to help... Tobin, you don't have to go if you don't want to. Why don't you all take a little time to think about it? Let's split up for now and meet back here later. I need to go thank my grandfather and say goodbye. Don't think he's gonna be very happy. Who are these voice actors? Ah, it's actually killing me. I know for a fact that I've I've heard Lucas's voice recently, and Alm's voice recently. I'm I'm like 99% sure I've heard them recently. And I think Faye, I mean, Faye kind of sounds familiar, but not really. Uh, I don't know. Okay, what else can I pick up? This is seriously killing me. That's disgusting. Hard bread? Who was it? There's a character that sounds exactly like Lucas. Like, basically exactly like Lucas. The same mannerisms as well. Like, really calm. And, uh, cool and collected, that kind of voice. Is Tobin an archer? I heard the class changing in this game is very different than uh, in recent Fire Emblem entries, I guess. Okay. Take all the time you need, Alm. You should pay your respects to Sir Myson. Oh my god, who is this guy? Oh, this is killing me. I don't actually have Lucas in Heroes, so I, I wouldn't know who the voice actor is unless I looked it up. Okay. Let's go to the square and see if there's anything new. Doesn't seem like it. It's a pitchfork there. Grandfather, I'm home. It's not going to be very happy. There's something I need to speak with you about. Grandfather? Hmm. Huh. Where is he? Grandfather? Grandfather! Uh-oh. He's going to end up dying, probably. The old guy always dies. No one to speak to, foreshadowing. Not really. So the pulsing mark is where you need to go, oh, I guess. Um, over here! Tobin! Does this mean you're coming with us? Sure am. I can tell Ma and Pa we're worried, but I think they'll understand. Listen, everyone. Try not to be amazed when I show Alm up on the battlefield. This guy's gonna suck, you isn't he? they don't pay extra for that, right, Moneybags? There's nothing wrong with fighting for coin. Many people do. We don't have any rules stating one's reasons must be noble. Now then, Alm. Were you able to say goodbye to your grandfather? I tried, but I couldn't find him. Well, that is vexing. I suppose we could tarry here a bit longer if you... It's all right. Let's go. Oh, are you certain? I can write him a letter. Come on. We can't wait forever. So be it. I'll defer to your judgment. What about Faye and Cliff? I guess they're not joining then. 
Cloud can actually just leave the village. I'm coming too. Oh, she is. I'm staying with you no matter what. End of discussion. Wait, I cannot recruit her? Why would I not recruit her? You know, I guess I don't mind going along. The Deliverance is fighting all across Sophia, right? Well, I've always wanted to see the world, and now's my chance. All I have to do is not get killed. Easy, right? <laughs> oh my god. So, th so they're optional recruits. That's interesting. Can I recruit the old man who wants wine? I'm pretty sure if he gets paid... He can get his wine. See? He wants his wine. He should come with us. He should be a good Jagan. Oh, we're actually leaving. Home. Are you sure about this? Am I sure about what? Not saying goodbye to your grandfather. My mom and pa have all my brothers and sisters to look after them. I mean, sure, they'll miss me. <laughs> or I hope they will, at any rate. But family will help them get by, you know? But all Sir Mycin has for kin is you. And all you have is him. I know. But considering he's never let me take one step outside the village, I doubt I could have talked him into letting me join an army. Not that it would have changed things either way. I have to go. Not just to prove him as a teacher, but to prove myself to me. Well, you've always wanted to put Ram behind you, right? This is your big chance. Your first adventure writ large. We'll call it Alm's Epic. Or maybe The Tale of Grey. Plus that one guy. <laughs> I don't think so. Although... I admit, there might be a little something to what you're saying. It's almost as if I feel someone calling out to me. So you really have gone crazy then? Well, it's been nice knowing you. <laughs> Look, I know how it sounds, but it's the truth. Do you think it's Celica? What? Celica? <laughs> Where the heck did that come from? Oh, please. You two were inseparable while she was here. You barely made any time for us. I guess that's true. Maybe it is her. Celica. Are you the one who's been calling me? I know that you're out there. I just don't know where. But I can feel it. I hope this journey will bring us together again. <laughs> 